nothing like a morning coffee to start the day. I'm just getting set up. I've got a few early morning meetings today. We'll get started there. Work should be, I'd say work will be an average day. I have like one or two things I really want to get done today, but it shouldn't be too bad. As far as what's on the docket um, outside of work, I want to hit the treadmill later this afternoon after work, keep my new fitness regimen going. I think uh, I think I've been doing all right. I've my leg has been. I mentioned this in one of my other videos, but my leg was like it wasn't like injured, but just from not working out, I had like this twinge. I don't, I don't know how else to explain it. It's almost like it was like like uh, not a cramp, but it was almost like a kind of like a weird like it like tightens up. You know, it's not a cramp per se where it hurts and it's didn't feel like sharp pain, but it's just like you know. So I've been letting it rest. Anyways, it feels better, so today I think I'll get back on the treadmill. It's raining outside, it's nasty. It's, it's warm enough, but it's, it's cloudy and nasty, so probably won't do any outdoor activities or DoorDash than I can think of. Um, and then I wanna make some dinner later. I'm gonna make some sweet and sour chicken. I've got everything I need for the recipe, so it'll be a pretty chill day, but we'll get started. Let's get some work done and we'll kinda go from there. Work is done. I've got to run to the store. I need like two or three quick things. There's like something every day pretty much because of the, uh, <laughs> because of moving in and stuff. But we've been trying to like complete a couple of the rooms. Our closet, like our master closet is one of the things that I've been working on over the last few days. And we just don't have enough hangers. Before we didn't have enough closet space. So we had everything like in drawers or actually a lot of stuff in boxes that we didn't really wear in our last place. So now we have closet space, but we don't have hangers to put this stuff up. So there's always a problem, but run and get hangers and then come back, work on the house a little bit and then hit the treadmill after that. As I've said, we're pretty much at the store every day, <laughs> but we're, we're gonna get it done. It's definitely not as nice as it was yesterday, but luckily I'm not door dashing or anything like that. We're just gonna get in and out real quick. So I need to get a bunch of hangers from here at Target, and then I'm gonna go to the grocery store next door because I have this very special, like fresh squeezed lemonade that my wife likes. So we'll get her some of that. She'll be really happy. Then we'll head home, work on the house. So it's it's a pretty easy day today. Not too bad. Like I said, I'm still gonna work out after all this, and I I can't wait. But I've been put on uh, husband duty before I can get on the treadmill. But we'll fit everything in. So uh, let's let's get through this rain. All right, I guess we get gray, black, or white. These white ones look different for some reason. These are like thicker. These are like the regular ones. We just need regular, so maybe I'll get two grays. The rain really started coming down right as I was coming out, of course. That's how it always goes. We got our hangers. We got two packs of these. That'll be more than enough. And I forgot to mention, I've got to drop this off. I need to find like a, one of those blue like post office boxes. It's uh, when I moved my voter registration it required some form i think because we've moved states multiple times and i've moved so much recently they're like you need to verify a few things so i did it and um just have to drop it in the box and then we'll be good to go so on to the lemonade with a possible pit stop at a mailbox this is our special lemonade first time Market all natural. Get like three of them. This is the wife's favorite. We're making good time even though we're getting wet. Not too wet, my hoodie's getting wet. But we'll keep it back up when we go out. Alright, when I was coming over to the to the grocery store, I did see a blue box. And it was like facing the other way, so I said we'll hit it on the way back. Half of me is like I don't even want to uh, get out in the rain i'll just do it tomorrow but when you got a thing when you got something on a list you can check off check it off don't leave it till tomorrow then you have to deal with it anyway so there'll just be something lingering on my mind or sitting in my car so we'll get it get this off the list and then we'll get home i feel good i'm feeling i've been like really feeling very productive the last couple days and did my taxes, 
been doing good at work. House is coming together. Sun is doing well. So it's pretty good. It's pretty good. So, all right, here's the post box. So let me just drop this and we'll be ready to go. Done. Now imagine if I just said, eh, it's raining. I'll do it tomorrow. It'll be one extra thing to think about, one extra thing on my mind. Clutter in the mind is not good. We'd have clutter in the mind, it's more stress. And all for 10 seconds, not even. Got it done so quick. All right, so I'm gonna head home, work on the house a little bit. Like I said, I wanna get to this damn treadmill. I'm not, I'm not making an excuse, I'm not giving up or skipping on it today, I'm doing it. We just gotta get everything else done before it. All right, we'll come back and deal with this later. I know I'm just jumping from thing to thing, but if this pile of empty boxes is an indication, we've completed a lot, we did a lot. So, man, what time is it? It's almost seven, I'll tell you, I don't even understand where the time goes anymore, but never too late. I said I was gonna do it. I'm really not in the mood to do it, to be honest. I'm tired, but I'm doing it. So let's get on, let's do, let's see how long we go for. I have a number in my head, we'll, we'll see if we make it. And then after that, I'm gonna make some good dinner. And then finally, maybe we can relax and enjoy the evening. So we'll see. But for now, let's get the heart racing. One mile down, feeling pretty good. I was talking in past videos, my show with my brother, Houston Harvey, which normally we do on Tuesdays, but this week we're not doing because he just had a baby yesterday. So <laughs> probably not the uh, probably not the best time to be streaming together, but and I'm happy for him. So we'll get back to that show eventually. It's not a big deal. But we talked. It's actually. I should say it's actually a perfect time for a little bit of a break because um, we talked a lot about wanting to be, I guess you could call motivating figures, to be people who motivate others to exercise, to take care of themselves, to be really good parents as we're deep into the parenting lifestyle. And um, the one problem is what I've told him and what he agrees is we're both not quite in the shape we need to be to be able to lead by example. So I'm really using this time to catch up to where I need to be. And I'm feeling good. I'm feeling positive, I'm feeling motivated. So hopefully by the time things kind of settle with the baby and he's ready to go again and we're ready to do some more videos, we're gonna be uh, in tip top shape, or at least on our way to tip top shape. So that's at least how I feel right now. So one mile down, we'll keep going. Two miles. Two and a half miles. I wanted to go 45 minutes. We're at 47 and a half. Two and a half miles was close. So I said, well, 45 is one thing. We'll go a little bit more. Two more minutes just to get to two and a half. But again, not a, in any way a blistering pace or anything super crazy. But it's definitely a... Uh, Definitely a start. I feel good. Heart rate up a little bit, but not like running. But I'm also just concerned about running too hard and hurting myself and then ruin the whole thing. So I'm just kind of easing into it. And once this gets easy, start running a little bit more. It's just getting easier. So. <sighs> I'm gonna make some dinner. I'm gonna make some Chinese food some sweet and sour chicken, got some peppers, some onions. I think it'd be pretty good. So let me wrap up here. Oh, whoa. Drop the uh, <laughs> the magnet thing. Don't necessarily always wear these in the gym because I feel like if you fall, somebody will see you. But here, I'm by myself. Okay. 
Now I've got to just put this up out of the way and we're good to go. So what do you say? Cool off for a second and then we'll be cooking. Quite simple, but we will get started. That's all you need. good i'm not gonna lie that was pretty good i'm not like the best cook ever but once in a while i can pull it together and i think that one was uh rock solid made the wife pretty happy so i feel good about that wrapping up another eventful long day it's actually 11:33, so it's it's been quite a while since dinner uh took a shower changed all that you know um so it's been fun. It's been fun making these little uh, a day in the a day in the goose life. It's taken me so long and probably taken me up to the point of having a kid before I was able to come up with um, to start like making videos and content for myself and not just for what I thought other people liked. And ultimately, this is the kind of thing that I've always wanted to do. I find it enjoyable to film throughout the day. I find it enjoyable to put the videos together. I find it enjoyable to just talk to the camera, film, be part of it, whatever. And I think I like this and I like doing this more than I care about if I'm doing something that's going to be super popular or something that's going to get a million views or something like that. I've had a few videos that have done well in YouTube in the past. And I'm actually kind of happy that I'm not really worried about that anymore. I just want to keep making my videos my way for me. I'm not really streaming that much at the moment. I'm sure I will stream more. I want to do the trail chats again. That was really fun. When I look back at like all the streaming I did, I'm like, what did I like and what did I not like? And the the one specific thing that I really enjoyed was the tra the trail chats. And I want to do those again. So I'm sure I'll do some of those. But overall, I just want to make my daily videos. I want to do my vlogs. I want to have fun. And the fact that probably very few people have made it this far in the video and maybe no one will ever see this part. It's okay by my, it's okay in my book. I enjoy it. I'm just doing this for fun. And it's kind of like the modern day, like the modern day way of like having a journal, right? You just express your thoughts here and there, puts your, put some perspective on things. And I don't know just kind of opens your mind. So I, I think I'm really gaining something from this and I've, I don't know, this is, this is it. This is all I want to do. I want to have my family. I want to have fun. I want to work hard on the things that matter. And for the videos, I just want to have uh, a little bit of a vlog. So it's been another day in the goose life and I will see you all later.